Hey, what's up guys? So it's week four of this training block. It's crazy to think how fast time is going by, but we start out here Tuesday morning with an upper body day today. Today's main lift is incline bench press, worked up to a top end set at 198 pounds by five reps. That's one pound off my all time five rep max on the incline bench press, but this set was a lot smoother. Following that, we then had four additional back off sets at 178 pounds by five reps. So we cruised right through those. Then we moved on to some T-bar rows, performed five sets from 15 to 20 reps at 105 pounds. And these are an absolute grind. Um, I did adjust my form after this first set, lowering my torso so it's more parallel to the ground. So I got more activation in my lats. Following that, we then have a super set of three rounds with two exercises. The first exercise being suspension face pulls, performing 15 reps for each round. And then the second exercise being reverse hyper rope face pulls, performing 15 to 20 reps at 75 pounds. So I went 20 reps the first round, that was 18. Then I finished out strong with another 20 reps there. So you can bet my rear delts were filling it after all that volume there. Following that, we then moved on to some lying barbell tricep extensions, performed four sets at 72 pounds by 20 reps. And let me tell you, even though it was only a two pound increase, I definitely felt that my triceps had a crazy pump after that but this is having a huge carryover towards my bench press, which is awesome. And then we finished the workout off with some rope tricep press downs, just performed two sets from 12 to 20 reps at 50 pounds. And my triceps were already so fatigued, so I just barely got 12 reps for both those sets. So definitely a struggle there. But overall though, it was a great workout. Glad to see how these lifts are improving, but I'm excited to get back under the bar on Thursday morning for leg day. All right guys, we're back. It's Thursday morning and it's leg day, the best day. And today's main lift is deadlifts. Worked up to a top end set at 318 pounds by six reps. That is a new six rep max for me. Felt really good, felt really smooth, but we also performed three sets at this weight. So that wasn't a volume PR, but that's the most times I've ever lifted over three plates. So really happy about that and how my deadlift is progressing. Lots of room for growth and we're inching towards that four plate milestone, so that is very encouraging. Following that, we then moved on to some belt squats, performed five sets at 187 pounds by 20 reps. So that's 100 reps total, that's a lot of volume, and I definitely got that burn in my quads, my glutes, and my hamstrings there. And this definitely had me working because I was sweating like a madman. But honestly, even though the weight was only increased by five pounds, I actually felt it a little bit easier than last week. So definitely noticing some strength build up on this lift. And then we finished the workout off with some body weight razor curls, performed eight sets with a five pound dumbbell by six reps. And uh, these are feeling really good too. Lots of progress on these. Um, definitely got a good burn on my hamstrings though. And the last few reps were absolute grinders, but managed to push through and crank out six reps across all eight sets. So all in all, great workout. Very posterior chain oriented, but that's okay because that's the base to a solid foundation. What's going on guys? So it's Saturday morning. Upper body did today, and I was definitely well rested for this one. Slept good, and uh, we cruised right through this workout. But we started out here on bench press, worked it to a top end set at 225 pounds by six reps. That is a new six rep max for me and an all time PR at this weight, and it felt good. I was a little bit anxious and nervous going into this lift, but we cruised right through it. Um, following that, we then had four additional back off sets at 203 pounds by six reps. We got some good volume in there. After that, we then had some supinated barbell rows performed five sets at 112.5 pounds by 15 reps, and definitely noticing some progress on this lift as my lats just continue to keep on getting stronger. And then after that, we had some wide grip pull downs, performed three sets at 135 pounds by 15 reps. And these are definitely starting to get more challenging, especially after performing all those rows, but they still just keep on progressing at that 2.5 pound progression every two weeks. And then we moved on to some arm work after that. Started out with some weighted tricep dips. Performed four sets at a total weight of 215 pounds by 10 to 12 reps. So that's plus my body weight plus 19 pounds. So we got 12 reps first three sets. And the last set was only able to get 11. But that's definitely noticing some progress there. Especially after last time I did this. So that's a win. And then we finished the workout off with some incline spoon press, performed two sets with 40 pound dumbbells by 20 reps. And let me tell you, my triceps were so fatigued after that, but I managed to push through and hit the top end rep range. So all in all, it was a great workout. Glad with how these lifts are progressing, 
But I'm ready to get back into the bar tomorrow morning for leg day. All right, guys, it's Sunday morning, leg day, the best day, but I was feeling a little bit tired coming into this one, but I was definitely highly caffeinated. But we started out here on the low bar back squat, worked up to a top end set at 309 pounds by six reps. This ties my all time PR at this weight and this amount of reps. But honestly, even though it felt extremely tough underneath the bar, it looked a lot smoother than I actually felt. So I guess I'll take that as a win. And then after that, we had four additional back off sets at 278 pounds by six reps. So we got some volume work in there. Following that, we then had some SSB good mornings, performed four sets at 115 pounds by 15 reps. And uh, these are feeling good. It's a five pound increase, so that's a PR there. And I'm really focusing on maintaining a tight core here and keeping a flat back throughout the entire movement to protect the spine and continue to build my strength there. And then we finished the workout off with some reverse hyper extensions, just performed five sets at 202.5 pounds by 12 reps. So also some more posterior chain work in there. But overall though, it's been a great week of workouts. Really happy with how everything is progressing. The progress may be slow, but it's very consistent. So thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on IG, follow me on TikTok, and let's just keep working towards our goals in the gym and in life each and every day.